Sports stuff. Sports stuff. This is a show about sports stuff, all about your stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Josh knows all about sports stuff, all about sports stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on in and join the show. Hello, how are you? Welcome to Sports Stuff. I am your host, Joshua Leland Evans. I have decided to do this entire show in foreign accent. Why? I have no idea. But it doesn't really matter, does it? Oh, it fell. It fell. Okay, so I want to talk about so many things today. And uh, you wonder why I did not do the theme song the normal way. Well, because this is a very special day. I have no idea why, but it is special. But every day is special. You know that? It's good. So I do this show. I'm not making fun of no one. I don't speak English very well. You don't need to make fun of me. So I guess I have good concept. I am not, Josh Evans could not make it today. I am his twin brother, Sergei. And I have, uh, we were separated at the birth, and I went off to a foreign country. I cannot say where because there are, there are reasons. I cannot tell you. But anyway, now this is the other thing. I do the same thing that Joshua does, this, all the time. I have no idea. Why do I do that? Why does he do that? Very much like the American movie Twins. The Twins with the Arnold the Schwarzenegger and the, the very small man, Danny DeVito, he midget, or small person, I don't know, which is correct. And uh, you remember they make the same, you know, characteristic motions and they eat the same way and it's very funny. So that's right, Josh does the same thing. So I was discussing today with uh, producer Gary Mama. And uh, yes, that's right, Gary Mama. And uh, he said, suggest I do something to stop myself from doing this. So I'm going to, in future, if I, oh, Josh Heller is here. Hello, Josh. Sorry, the real Josh Evans could not make it. Instead, it's me, Sergey. So anyway, so uh, we put the, the sandpaper. On, under the nose here, which this is called what? It's called the, the I don't know. It could be called many things. The, the, the Pipic, that's the Pipic. So, the hello, hey, hey, Josh. Yeah, I said hello. Oh, you're saying back. So, oh, okay, I'm sorry. Very, very sorry. So, we put it in the Pipic and we put the sandpaper, it hurts and no longer be done. Okay, anyway, so enough of that. So I want to uh, show you some things that I have for the sports stuff. And uh, first thing is a baseball card thing. I don't understand why these baseball cards sold for so much money. It's a crazy thing. Because when I grew up, we had no, no baseball cards. We had, uh, we had uh, uh, pieces of little paper, and we do our drawings on them, and that's all we have. And we trade these. And I'm a very bad artist, so my drawings nobody wants. It's OK. So anyway. Here is the paper with the picture of the baseball cards. And this one is a, a uncut sheet. Now, uncut has nothing to do with something else, which we don't talk about. But uh, that's something that we, in my country, we not do. And in this country, many do. But uh, we don't talk about that because it's, a, it's not nice. Not, not, not nice for the, the public. So anyway... These are baseball cards of many players. And what's nice, uh, according to Josh, is that they're not cut, uncut, and th th that's good. But I don't understand this. Why not good, uncut? They should be cut. Why do you want this with the, not with the cutting? You see, they have the pictures. And uh, very, very nice. You've got the Stan Musial here. Yes, he's a good one. And uh, that's, uh, I think, the Bobby Brown. Not the, the Whitney Houston guy, who's not good man. You know, the whole thing with the drugs and the crazy and the bathtub and the water is not good. And then the daughter, same thing, terrible. Uh, but I like that song. What's it called? Uh, jump back, do something Michael Jackson like? I don't know. 
So and the, and here's the Yogi Berra. And uh, what did where's Yogi Berra? There he is. You see? Oh, there he is, right there. Here. Yes, that's the one who they named the uh, the uh, uh, the bear in the cartoon, Yogi Bear. Yogi Bear. So anyway, that's nice. 1948. It's the Bowman, not the Tops. Bowman, very sad. Go out of business. Top buy them, and uh, they make no money. Just like me, I make no money. I work in the school. I work in a school and I uh, take care of the floor. I sweep the floor, I mop the floor, and I'm happy. You know, I come home, I have the Swanson's TV dinner, everything good. So anyway, what else do we have? Yes, we have a nice little book. Baseball, no, scientific baseball pitching. Now I like this because it's very technical, you see? Very unusual. This book, only one in the world. And uh, why? Because who wants to read a book about the pitching being scientific? We want to have the fun. You know, we want to play and uh, talk about the people, talk about the players and all this. And this is no good. But it's very good because so tough, so difficult, impossible to find. And the only one who read the book is this man here, or maybe woman, M.G. Whitney, 1904, many years ago. But I like this book because it has the very scientific, very nice, very rare. The picture on the back, very nice. He wrote in here what he paid or what they asked. This is what he paid, 28 sep. What? Almost 3,000 rubles for this book. Too much. Bad deal. Bad deal. My brother, not too small. Anyway, what else do we have? Ah, yes. The boxing. I like the boxing. The boxing is good because, uh, yes, you kick some butt. It's good, yes. Now, this is nice. This is from England. Yes, and you know this. It's a very good quality. Yes, you see the wood is so nice, and that's original. There's no repaint. And this is a good quality. And even this, the strings the, the, uh, for the ring, the ropes, but the strings, so it's not rope. But uh, And the, the very nice detail on the fighters. See that? Very nice. And this is trophy. They make this, you put plaque, but no plaque ever, because this looked like it never saw it. You know, it's it not... It not uh, it not damaged. It's like brand new, and uh, so uh, this trophy, very nice. You know, somebody buy, win the title. You know, Muhammad Ali, Joe Lewis, or just the guy, Stony McGlynn, or whoever his name is. Who's Stony McGlynn? I know that name. I think he baseball player or circa nineteen ten. Anyway, so this nice, and a uh, boxing very good. We have the boxing in our auction coming up. Big collection. You must, if you collect boxing, this is the thing to look for. We are the place. Leland's. Leland's. That's right. And uh, we have. We have the boxing. So look for it in our next monthly, the monthly auction. Josh has the monthly auction. And, uh, and then again in the winter. And I think it's uh, January. End of January. The big auction. Now, if you are interested, you want to see this auction, the catalog, etc., you send me email, Josh, J-O-S-H, or you send it to him, because you don't send it to Sergey. I don't have a job, I don't have any email. I don't have a computer, this is my brother's computer. So, you send it to josh at lelands.com, and we put you on the list. But I learned from my country, you never want to be on the list. Not good. Not smart. So be careful. You get on this list. So anyway, what else do we have? Ah, this is, this is nice. Okay. Ah, here we go. This is very interesting. Now. This is a uh, very old, 1965, 1966. 
and uh, I like this very much. These are the unopened packs of the baseball, uh, not the baseball cards, these non sported cards. And there, this hang in the store on a, uh, a little rack. <laughs> and uh, this goes on it with the hole. It's got a little hole. And the, the, the children, they take this off, they open up this this they open up this plastic here and underneath the cards the packs again they're wrapped in the cellophane and uh what's interesting my great great grandfather yuri he invent the cellophane but of course they steal the invention and the uh, american get very bad same thing with uh, the light bulb uh what is his name thomas edison he steal it from uh, the other guy what's his name check this about it. Is he Czechoslovakian? Yes. What is his name? Uh, uh, oh, I can't think. It's not good. So anyway, this is a real unopened, very, 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 very difficult to find and wonderful because you never know what's inside. And inside mint, beautiful cards. And this is a rare one. I I like this very much because I like the James Bond. He's good. He's very funny. And he gets a nice girl. Pussy galore. Now, I not say that. I not say that to be Tesla. Yes, the Nicholas Tesla. Thank you. George had to tell me who the, the guy with the electrical is. And I think uh, David Bowie do something about him. I don't remember. But now look at this. This is very interesting. Now, this is the Batman. We love the Batman. And this is much more interesting, I think, than the James Bond, even though, you know, he's both good. Oh, you see that? They make the puzzle on the back. Now this, you have to be very careful. You see, George, he buys this. He buys this and he gets the header. This is the header card, right? And this is, they have inside the set. I cannot work this thing. This thing is the uh, cello, the packs in here, they unopened, but this bag here, it's not original. That's right. He find it, the header pack, and the the packs in there all three but the bag is a broken no good cannot do nothing with it no good so he goes to very very smart man very very uh, talented man and he make this look just like this it will look perfect right smart but be very careful because not worth so much not worth as much as this uh, perfect, maybe $2,000, $3,000, who knows? And uh, yeah, John Guzik here, he, he go to the show with me in the, in the, in the Allentown with the non-sports show, the big one. And we put this in the case and nobody know. And everybody want to buy more than anything. It's true. But it is not original, but we don't care because, uh, you know, it's just for us. I mean, I'd rather have it... Uh, the other way, but you know, and uh, we tell people the truth because that's what you must do. You cannot lie. You cannot tell things not not nice, not right. It's bad for everybody. It's bad for you. It's bad for them, and it's bad for the whole thing. That's right. Yes, John tells us everyone stopped to see just this, and it's not right. But doesn't matter. Looks good, and we tell truth. But it was not for sale. Because, uh, you know, Josh could not make it to the show. I, I went with John. And uh, eh, we we not sell anything. We not, this is from his collection. He loved this. He loved this. I like it too. Very nice. Look, Batman. da 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 Batman. da 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 Batman. Not Batman, but Batman. That's right. Not Batman, but Batman. Okay, you got it? No, that's not right. It's Badman. Not Badman, Badman. Okay, enough. I don't like. Who's on first? I don't know. Third base. Anyway, what else we have? Oh, I know. Oh, I don't think we should show this. This is not good. All right. All right, I show. Now, Josh. He liked the things 
the crazy things from years ago when he, you know, he kid, he do things, you know, not so, uh, not so. Oh, David Mooch here. David Mooch. Josh, tell me he meet his son. His son come to the sh to the office in in uh, New Jersey, and he bring his son. Very nice little boy. And I cannot. I, he never told me the name, so I don't know. But J Dave Mooch will tell us. And the boy very sweet. And he give him piece of candy. Yes, candy for free. Nice boy. Josh, good man, very good man. So anyway, so years ago, Josh, he smoked a little pot. Just, you know, no big deal. No, no, not anymore. Good evening, Dave Mooch. Good evening. It's like, uh, who say good evening? Mason, that's his name, Mason. I wonder if he is a Mason. You know the Masons, yes? They are not bad man. They are not even bad man. They are Mason. And, uh, they're very exclusive club. You can't get in. But anyway, we digress. So years ago, he smoked a little pot. Okay, so he still like, even though he's not smoked no more, he liked to have the things that uh, are like that, are represent, that are antiques, that are nice. This is very nice. You see what this is? This is the real thing. Years ago, the, 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 the marijuana, because well, they call it the cannabis, Cannabis uh, in, I believe, in Indica. Cannabis Indica. I do not know what the TR is. Trademark, maybe. Ah, could be. So this is nice. You see this here? This is, uh, this is painted. It painted on the inside, and then it showed from the outside. So it's very beautiful. If you paint it on the outside, not look no good, as good. And uh, this is, oh, look, very nice. And this, you go to the drugstore. You order the uh, cannabis for uh, whatever. You know, they, no, they, they not put it in the Coca-Cola. That was the cocaine, which is not good. Not very bad. And uh, so they, 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 they dispense this, the, pharm the pharmacy. Yes, yes, it's very, it's nice. Yeah, you like, I like. Oh, see, the other side. Yeah, that's that's what the labor. Nice, I like this. This is this is nice. Valuable, two thousand dollars, two thousand. Crazy stuff. Okay, what else? Do we have anything else? I like to talk about something. Very much, we talk about the the man, the comic book man, Stanley. Now his name is really. Stan Lee, and his name is also Stan Lee, but his real name is Stanley Lieber. He's a Jew man. That's nice. I like the Jew man. My brother Jew man. I'm not. Not me. So anyway, Stan Lee wrote uh, the comic books, the, the Marvel comic books, uh, Captain uh, Captain America. Uh, the Big Hulk and uh, the Thor and uh, who is the Iron, the, the Man of Iron and uh, the Silver, the Surfer, you know, you know so poor. Oh, very nice, right? He get much credit, make much money, billions, trillions of dollars because uh, he get uh, all the credit. His name is on there. He owned the company or he worked for the company. His brother, his brother-in-law owned the company. So he get everything. Now, the other man, he not uh, write the comic. He draw the comic. Now, comic book, the drawing is very, very important. The writing is important too, but the drawing is almost everything. So, uh, oh, you ask what the Josh's name of the eBay is? It depends. Uh, which which one? We have the uh, Evans Archive. Evans Archive. We have the, uh, yes, that's the one. That's the one you want to know. Evans Archive. Yes, I happen to know that. They're much very difficult, man. Hard to deal. He, he liked the wrestler. He liked the, not like the Tesla, he liked the wrestler. Anyway, 
So I got to go over very soon. So I'm not happy. I'm not happy. The Stanley take all the credit. And this brilliant, brilliant man, Jack Kirby, the most brilliant. That's right, hockey. Okay, don't interrupt. So they mooch again with the interruptions. <sighs> Always with the interruptions. So anyway, with the hockey, not the hockey, the Stanley take all the credit, Jack Kirby nothing. And he, he drew all these brilliant guys. He drew them. The, the, uh, not the Spider-Man. Spider-Man is another guy, Steve Ditko. He gets screwed too. So I'm not like Stanley so much. He take all the credit. Poor Jack Kirby, got no money, he died. Now, finally, they put the name on the screen. When they have the movie, the Thor movie, it says by Stanley and Jack Kirby. So finally, but Stanley, he no help his friend. Take all the credit, he's in the movies. He like, uh, who's he like? Uh, what's his name? Uh, not the biggie, not the smallie, the uh, a puffy, the puffy daddy. He, in all the videos, right, take the credit. And uh, the other guy, who is it, uh, the big guy, the kid people, he's like, oh, all up in the videos. So Stanley is kind of like the puff daddy. So anyway, I'm sorry that Stanley died. I don't like that. But Jack Kirby, he died too, and he don't get the credit. So this show, I dedicate to Jack Kirby, the greatest comic artist of all. Genius. Okay? That's right. I say goodbye. I say goodbye to the John Jay. I tell you, please, the Twitter and the, uh, the Facebook and the following and the texting and the writing and the technology, it all out of control. But I'm happy to be here. And uh, you have a nice day. Good night. But again, the team song. Hold on. I got to get it for Gibor for the But I practice in the American voice. Okay? But you know what? I do in the accent. Okay? Oh, he broke him. I turn it on. <laughs> I'm turning this on too. Oh, wait. Yeah, it's very nice. This is a show. This is a show about sports stuff. All about sports stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sergey knows about sports stuff. All about sports stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hope you really like the show. Yes. I say goodbye to all my American friends. Bye from Sergey. You come back. Hopefully Josh not here. I take over. That's right. We're moving in. <laughs>